and today I'm going to be having a look at the Hot Toys Ant-Man on Flying Ant miniature collectible and it is just a statue there's no articulation or anything this would be a great piece for inbox collectors because they really set it up nice in there this window packaging you can see it from three sides really good so that would be really good just to leave in box I'm gonna actually take it out of the box and set it with my other Avengers but you do have a good option of leaving it in there I'm assuming that that is Anthony it doesn't actually say it's Anthony anywhere but to me that's Anthony maybe Anthony wouldn't sign over the rights to his likeness I'm going to get this out of the box now so we can have a closer look at it. Okay, now I have Ant-Man and Anthony out of his packaging. And first thing I did was break this stand when I was opening the box. So I then had to spend 20 minutes trying to dig the broken piece out of that base. And then super gluing this one back in. If anybody out there purchases one of these, watch out for that. I may have been better off leaving it in the box. Now here's the Ant-Man on Anthony, and this thing feels like it'd probably be a little bit fragile too, like these wings are thin plastic, and these legs are. They're a little flexible, but I don't think they're real flexible to where they wouldn't break, but it looks terrific. And I actually got this to set along with my Avengers. And it is a little out of scale with my 6 inch Avengers. The good thing about Ant-Man is you could pretty much put him in any scale you want. And, you know, I could have bought a larger Marvel Select Ant-Man and got away with it. But I really like this small one on this ant. It is very well made, well painted. You can see all those details in that paint. A little bit of brown with that black in there. Which it is a Hot Toys collectible, so, you know, you kind of expect that. These wings, I don't think I've ever seen a better set of wings on a toy ant. Looks great. Love the details they put in there. And I didn't know ants took gas, but he's got a gas can. <laughs> it looks like a gas tank on a motorcycle on there. I guess it's for Ant-Man to lay over on. But what a cool looking piece. And I think it'll look great with my Avengers. This ant is almost the size of my 6 inch Avengers though. So maybe Ant-Man shrunk himself and then he hit the ant with one of the uh, blue discs that makes it grow. That's my explanation. See if I can get close in on the Ant-Man's face. So there's a close up of the tiny Ant-Man on the ant. And I think he looks great. I think his costume looks great to be on such a small scale. I think it looks awesome. Nice helmet. So now I'll give you a nice 360 degree close up of this Hot Toys Ant-Man on Flying Ant statue. And I think it's great. This piece was around $35 and I wanted it to add an Ant-Man to my Avengers. And honestly I couldn't be happier with it even for that price. It's just absolutely incredible looking. And I just really like it. If you do find yourself purchasing one of these, be careful with that stand getting it out of packaging. That is all I have for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to subscribe to keep up with videos. Thank you guys. Bye.